Oh, hi, guys. Oh, hi. Joan of Arc. Yeah. Several people, English, not their first language. John Embury. Pardon me? John Embury. Why can't you say your person's name? I was going to go for Philip de Freitas, but then I worried that maybe he sounds a bit French. John Embury. No more people. A little bit of Googling. And half of the first ten photos are white trousers. Oof. Henry Hoover. Do you mean the Hoover or the President? I don't think there's been a President called Henry Hoover yet. Not far off. No more people who, if you take one letter out of their surname, you've got a verb. In this case, hover. All right, we'll challenge then. He's done it. I don't think English is a Hoover's first language. (laughs) I think is a Hoover's first language. What do you think his first language is? English. (laughs) Can you prove it? By the way, I've only seen him speak once, and it's in your show where uh, you've got Henry Hoover... Who says, but, 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 but Henry Hoover. Yeah, but that's me I saying that. He's a bit of a character, isn't he? No, he's a Hoover. He's you weren't going for the character Henry Hoover, were you? Henry the Hoover. I didn't say a, a vacuum cleaner, did I? I didn't say a, f- a, a blender. I said Henry the Hoover. You yeah, but that's that. a Hoover. Yeah, but that's a, it's, he's, perso- he's a personification, isn't he? He's a, he's, a, he's a little chap who's a Hoover. Yeah, exactly. He's a Hoover. And I think a Hoover's first language isn't English. You've got to remember, in my show, it's a trumpeter with a hoover on his head. Called Henry, Henry the Hoover? No, called Joe. <laughs> Is it if I Google where, where they're made? No, it's a hoover. But when, but when Henry the Hoover talks... My <laughs> argument is Henry the Hoover doesn't talk because he's a hoover. I'd, I'd be in a much better position here if you didn't have a show where you have Henry the Hoover doing a song. <laughs> yeah, but you've got to remember, we don't have Henry the Hoover doing a song. We've got Joe Auckland with a hoover on his head doing a song. Oh, yeah? What's, oh, how do the lyrics go? Doodle-a-la-la to Henry Hoover. doodle a to Henry... He's a short little fat guy. He's wearing a hoover on his head, this chap. Your argument is that when Joe puts it on his head, he speaks. If you're, you're saying your character was the Henry the Hoover from our show, is that your argument? My argument is sort of a floating argument, I must admit. <laughs> Tricky one, actually. I mean, I reckon you could probably find an example on the internet of another country using Henry the Hoover and voicing it. And if that was before our show, I'd probably say that was the first language. I don't think we were probably the only people to voice Henry the Hoover. That's quite a good argument. I've heard worse things said. What is Henry Hoover's first language? It's an English name, but then it could be Henri. It does say the vacuums are all based on British names. It is a British manufacturer. His first language would be English. Well, you think when he finally speaks, it will be English? We've got a philosophical dispute because... Big, big finally. It's a big finally. <laughs> I think they will be discontinued before they talk. It's an English company. I think it's like going for, You know what I think it's like going for? Big Ben. You think Big Ben's first language is English? I'd be surprised if it's German. I'd be surprised if it's English. I think it's Bong. You think it's Bong? I think his only language is Bong, and I think Henry's only language is... I think he speaks Hoover. Well, if you said Lockie, the dog, what's her first language? English, I'd say. 